Hello everyone, my name is Marta Kopinska and together with David Lasagavaster from the University of the Basque Country in Spain, we would like to present a study about digital abilities and attitudes towards new technologies in foreign language classroom. ICTs, information and communication technologies, are nowadays the substantial part of the basic knowledge in our society as they affect every area of our life communication and learning. It is thus important that the students learn how to make use of the technologies in the classroom in order to develop their digital skills and abilities and to know how to learn through them. So the integration of computer-based learning in the classroom, in our case is the foreign language classroom, could enable us to reach the same. Attitudes towards the use of ICTs in English as foreign language classroom may affect students' learning process as attitudes with the behavioural implications are considered an influential factor by many scholars in the field of second language acquisition. In the same vein, students' attitudes and learning may be influenced by their digital abilities, which can be better or worse. The previous studies in the field suggest that positive attitudes towards technologies are essential for successful learning as well as me the meaningful use of ICTs. And in general, positive attitudes towards the technologies were found among students. The present study focuses on the analysis of the role of digital abilities and attitudes towards the use of technologies as a basis for EFL classroom activities. By exploring the relationship between students' attitudes towards technologies and their self-reported digital ability. And this study is a preliminary phase of a larger project supported by a grant from the Basque government. The methodology is based on the ICT and Attitudes questionnaire adapted from the studies by Epinia and Kennedy and colleagues. The sample involves 27 high school students from Vitoria, Spain, which were engaged in an experimental project of technology use in EFL classes. In the present report, 44 items were analysed. 24 of them were on attitudes towards the use of technologies in learning environment whereas another 20 uh, concerned frequency of use of ICTs and digital abilities. Will the data reveal high self-reported frequency of use of technologies as student, students report that they use the technologies at least a few times a week up to once or various times a day? with the exception of items concerning the use of internet during English classroom activities, the use of internet in order to learn languages or to prepare English class homework, PowerPoint use, sharing photos on the internet or reading and commenting on blogs are not that popular. They report they use them once a week or once or twice a month. The data review also high self-reported digital ability as the students regard themselves very good to quite good with the technologies. And they say so even with the technologies that are not used frequently by them. As far as attitudes towards the technologies are concerned, the data show students' overall positive attitude as they say they would like to use ICTs in their classrooms as it would improve the digital abilities and the students don't find it difficult to use technologies and they regard them interesting. Students consider ICTs useful in the language learning process and for their future careers. These results are in line with the previous studies in the field, however, scarce opportunities to learn through technologies in EFL classroom were revealed and the students are critical as far as the quantity and quality of school's equipment is concerned. Well, it is worth emphasizing that favorable attitudes are crucial for successful language learning, developing meaningful use of the ICTs 
and improving digital abilities of the students. Thank you.